Hey, it's Neil Dion from 93.7 B93. Welcome to my home. I feel like cooking. How about you? With the help of Spartan Stores, let me show you how easy it can be. One of the best things in the world to eat, in my opinion, is pork. And uh, something we don't eat enough of is the pork tenderloin. Problem is, a lot of people are scared of it because they're, they don't, they overcook it. They overcook it. And you get dry, tough pork. Your best friend is a plastic bag. I marinate it overnight in my favorite Italian uh, salad dressing. You saw me do that in our chicken episode. Let it sit here on the counter and rest and come down to room temperature about 30 minutes and you are ready to grill. Pork tenderloins are ready to rock and roll on the grill. I'm going to show you how to make these things perfect, juicy, and tender so that you love pork again. A little salt, pepper, and a little rosemary from my herb garden. Maybe a little garlic powder if you like. It's totally up to you. That's the beauty of cooking. It's, it's all about playing and having fun and doing things different. Now that is going to be amazing here in just a few minutes. I'm going to throw the cover on. Offset cooking method. See? The coals are not directly under the meat. We'll flip them. If I need to caramelize them at the end, that's what we'll do. This is your other best friend in the kitchen. Don't live without it. It's an instant reading thermometer. If somebody tells you your pork has to be cooked to smithereens, they're lying to you. I take mine off at 145. I let it rest so all the juices can redistribute through the meat. Then I slice, and you can cut this stuff with a spoon. You'll see here my rosemary encrusted pork tenderloin, Spartan brand. I got some beautiful uh, baby carrots at the uh, family fair up the road from us here. And uh, I just did those in a little butter and honey and steamed them. And then I have a spinach uh, and strawberry salad here. Uh, Spartan brand products, the Spartan brand sliced almonds on top, a little feta cheese. And you just look at that and tell me you don't want to eat that. <laughs> well, sorry to say this, but I'm gonna. See you next time.